sued for selling jewelry and he sued for copyright if jewelry copied other brand designs. That's a pretty good question. Let's start by going to AliExpress and let's search jewelry. So if you go here, all these products you can dropship and you should not have any copyright issues. Now let's say we search Cartier bracelet. So here there are a few Cartier looking bracelets but you can see AliExpress removes clear replicas so that you won't get copyright. Now let's go nail upper. These are the sort of Cartier looking bracelets. So one, these are all generic, like you can't get reported for copyright for some of these generic. Now these, this is usually the iconic Cartier bracelet. Now you can sort of see that this is similar but not the same. So Cartier is not gonna, like they can't, like a lot of jewelry is the same. So these brands can't report you for copyright because there's small differences. So check this out, like a bunch of other brands do it too. I'm trying to think because I saw like Tiffany. Oh, so Tiffany does it, but they have to do a different design, maybe due to copyright. Maybe due to copyright, Tiffany can't do the exact same thing, because maybe they have the design patented. So if I were you, I would just sell everything. If something gets big, like the nail, they wouldn't be suing you. They sh they'll be suing the Alibaba supplier, so you wouldn't get in trouble. So that's sort of my thoughts on copyright when it comes to dropshipping jewelry. So hopefully that answers your question. As always, if you really want to take this seriously and you really want to succeed in dropshipping, you want someone to walk you through the whole process, I highly recommend my one-on-one -on -one coaching program. I am really picky with who I work with because I only want to work with two or three very serious people at any given time. So there is a sort of filtering process, but if you're interested, you would have to go through steps one and two, go through my reviews, watch my content over the last three or four years, see if you want to even work with me if you've done one and two then you can go ahead and message me on instagram or email me at consulting and then from there i'll be able to give you the next steps because i only want to work with serious people that can sort of create a success story because my goal is to create 100 success stories from people worldwide i'm currently at 40 so i'm nearly there but yeah hopefully i was able to answer your question peace